Hi everybody, Salty Dog here. So here is my awesome soap swap haul. Okay, so we'll start off with Ken's soap, K. Busca, and please excuse me if I don't get your names right. Um, Ken did a beautiful fabric wrap, which I think is really, really pretty. I mean, the colors are fantastic for the autumn and the uh, raffia. And I love the very Halloweenish poem. So great job, Ken. I think it looks beautiful. I can smell it a little bit. Carrie's uh, Witch Elixir Spiderweb Soap. Oh my gosh, I love everything about this. I just love how it looks very spidery and scary in your little sticker and the color of the soap itself. And I really like your um, ingredient label here. It really looks very Halloweenish and scary. And when I read the ingredients and I wrote Facus Spiderus, I was cracking up. I think that is so cute. Really cute. I love everything about this, Carrie. I think that you did a really original, fantastic job. Thank you. Uh, this is Laura's really, really pretty wrapped cranberry orange tart. Uh, your three, 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 3113 Soap Company. Very cool name. I don't know what's behind it. Maybe you uh, wrote about it before, but that's really neat. Um, I just really like your, I really love the tissue wrap. I like that. And I love the colors. I love, love, love pink and green and kind of retro floral that you got going on there. And I like how you did all the different colors on the cards too, just to match your wrap. And I can't wait to see what the soap looks like. Thank you, Laura. These are Crafty 86's items. Um, I think they smell fantastic. And uh, Crafty, I think that your packaging is really simple and beautiful. I love the little, I don't know how you got that, um, where you got your stickers from, but I think that they're really nice and I. I love that um, very autumny photo on there and the simplicity of your craft paper. And the ginger snap um, body butter, I had to try. Oh my gosh, I uh, both items, I really, they smell fabulous. But the gingerbread butter, oh my gosh, I just wanted to eat it. It's beautiful. So these Thank are you. Tegan's two items. Thank you, Tegan, for sending in two items. That was really nice of you. Um, really impressed with the packaging. I don't. I'm anxious to see how you got this coffin shape, and the scent, the grass, and the dirt. Oh my gosh, that's like so cool, and it really smells exactly like grass and dirt. Um, I know that you had said it's a scrubby soap, and I love that. So I can't wait to try that. And the uh, Bone Balm Lotion Bar. I just love that. The packaging is great. I just love your packaging. It's, I know, I, I keep saying awesome, but it really is awesome. And I've never used a lotion bar before, so I'm very excited to try that. Oh so, my gosh, newbie. <sighs> this is just so spectacular. I feel like I keep saying the same words over and over again, but the soap itself, of course I had to peek. Um, it looks like, it reminds me of the movie Nightmare Before Christmas, which is one of my favoritest movies. I love the decoupage uh, picture that you put on there. I used to be huge into decoupage, and I really like the way that you wrote the ingredients with the metallic pen. Very handmade looking and crafty. And um, several of my girlfriends were over and everybody commented on your sealing wax. I think that's just so original. I've never seen anything like that. Um, and I love the way that it looks like blood and it smells really, really good. I don't know what the smell is. I guess, I guess you just call it night comes creeping. And it's fantastic. It okay, is fantastic. so this is Amanda's. Uh, I think you say it, anise and peppermint charcoal soap. The swirls are beautiful. I can't wait to take the wrapping off, but the, her, um, 
her her packaging is really really nice and it just looks so handmade and crafty with the little pumpkin and the fact that you identified SMS S SMF fall swap is really cute and I just bought this twine myself because I love it and I have to say that the anise and the peppermint is absolutely one of my favorite smells so far so thank you Amanda Crinkly, but it looks beautiful it's a large jar of body butter that was very generous of you I'm so happy that you sent body butter I mean Everybody sent a nice variety of items, um, and it looks beautiful. Uh, I love the, the bag and the little pumpkins, and your tag is awesome, and I can't wait to open it up and Very try crafted. It. Wow, that is one big piece of soap. Uh, I, your packaging is so Halloween-ish and awesome, and you sent candy, and I love candy. I'm a huge candy eater. So I will definitely be ripping open those Skittles, and um, it looks fabulous. I just can't wait to open this. Beautiful, thank you. Tasha's uh, Spiced Marmalade Lotion and Lip Balm. How beautiful is that? I mean, I can slide this down a little bit. I mean, your labels are just really gorgeous. And I snuck and used some of your lip balm um, it is fantastic. My daughter was trying to steal it, but she is a lip balm fanatic. I will not let her do that. Um, but your, I love the way that you use the fabric to keep the two items together. Just so, they smell, oh my gosh. Well, you all know, but I just love the way they smell. It's great. It's great. And that's a nice large bottle of lotion. Thank you so much, Tasha. Beautiful. Okay, so this is Fyra's Monster Soap. Fyra, I hope that I'm saying your name correctly. Um, I'm sorry, I think your box got a little crushed. I'm sure that it wasn't like this when you made it. And I know how hard boxes are because I was trying to make them for some gingerbread soaps that I was making. Um, so it's not an easy thing. Great sticker, Monster Cake Soap. I couldn't help it. I got really excited when I opened the package and I think I ended up throwing out your nice pink, uh, red rather tissue paper that you had in there and there's your awesome eyeball soap I can't wait to cut that in half I think I'm gonna cut it in half and use it it's very very large and it smells real good so fantastic packaging beautiful you are very skilled at making boxes I am not thank you very okay, much okay this is moon blossoms uh, pumpkin spice soap which is great I love pumpkin soap and uh, I really like that you used purple for uh, Halloween in your in your labeling and I really like your description here a luxurious blend of fragrances and oils designed to soothe the driest skin as only handcrafted soaps can and I think that that is true um, I think that it looks fabulous I love the little stickers that you added for interest, and I love, I always like twine, and the soap itself, I just, I can't wait to take the label off because I just really, really want to see the soap, but this is about um, labeling, so. They look wonderful. I mean, I, I can't, you know, I know this part's about packaging, but I, look at this top. I mean, I can't help but comment on this top. This is gorgeous soap, and I love the way the little packaging goes really well together. Um, the, they smell fantastic the body lotion of course I had to try it it's really really nice but there'll be more on it later I, harvest. Okay, I, think I thought I called it autumn harvest I've never used this fragrance oil before and unfortunately I had done some other pumpkins and they turned dark brown I can't even tell you how many hours it took me to do the layering in these soaps so I'm really hoping that it doesn't turn dark brown and that's what I get for not using a fragrance oil um, that I could find in the review, but I just thought that it smelled really good, so I hope they don't turn on you. And I You've been on my mind